As a result of the credit union's expansion into rural areas, its impact has been significant in the sense that the credit union offers its services both to the middle and lower classes, and it reaches areas where the banks and government don't offer services to help the people. We recently entered municipalities where there have been no other financial institution and there is no financial culture. The credit union is well accepted there. In Bolivia, where 70% of the people live below the poverty line and extreme poverty is concentrated in rural areas, the World Council of Credit Unions, WOKU, is working with 21 credit unions to reach the vast numbers of underserved Bolivians. Through credit unions, Bolivians have hope for better lives for their families and their communities. WOKU works intensively with these credit unions to raise levels of safety and soundness, offer innovative products, and expand access to the rural poor. Initially, we serve the Valle Grande municipality. Later, with the support and confidence of our members and with the technical assistance from WOKU, we decided to explore the possibility of expanding the credit union. In this way, we advanced to the point of being able to open branches in five other municipalities of the Valle Grande province. And we opened a branch in the Florida province in November of 2004. We offer many services, loans for agriculture, business, education, operation, construction, raising livestock. We offer regular savings accounts and fixed term savings. With WOKU's help, we offer new products of agriculture credit and program savings. We raise chickens and pigs and farm the land. We have been here for 10 years. We get our credit from the credit union. We have been able to build a chicken house and pig house and everything here. We started with 2,000 chickens and now we have 9,000. We hope to double the size of our farm. We go to the credit union because it charges lower interest. If it weren't for the credit union, we would have to go to the banks in Santa Cruz. But it's more difficult to get there and they ask for too much. Nothing is certain in this countryside. What I hope for is that my children have a better future than we have. With funding from the U.S. Agency for International Development, WOKU has transformed the credit union sector in Bolivia. WOKU works with credit unions to follow strict financial disciplines to make them safe and sound institutions. WOKU-assisted credit unions have been accepted by the superintendency of banks for formal supervision. Over the past four years, WOKU has created a national credit union network. The Ohio Credit Union League, partnered with Bolivia through WOKU's innovative International Partnership Program, was instrumental in providing technical assistance to create the Internet-based shared branching network. Through the network, called Servired, a credit union member who is traveling from her home in the country to the city to sell her products at market, can safely deposit her earnings in her home credit union account through the shared branching network. Servired can open market production networks. It's now possible for a buyer to transfer funds through Servired to the seller's account, even though the credit unions they use might be many hundreds of miles away. It also means that Bolivians can receive international remittances, money sent from relatives who are living and working abroad, through credit unions and through the project, WOKU has helped now strengthened credit unions open rural branches to serve the underserved poor. The credit union is the only institution we have for support because there isn't anything else. It's a serious and well-run institution. WOKU affiliated credit unions reach nearly 400,000 Bolivians, giving them access to safe and affordable financial services and a chance to build better lives for themselves and their families. For many of them, it's the only chance they have.